Nice lovely finish. finish. Yeah, really good. Really positive from, from Evans. Might be that like there, like a big lunge, and it's, it takes quite a lot out of you. That's a clever shot down the middle. He was trying to catch Bombalay out there with a shot down the middle of the court. Ah, oh, it's a wonderful nice. finish. That's the first one from Bombalay that's just been a, a bit more clinical, a bit more aggressive. The others, as you say, with the risk reward, it's just been a popping it in there, you know, Fairly high above the tin. Yeah. That's good left down the backhand side. Get the ball nice and high, so the opponent has to reach up. Yeah, just changing the paces up here, going from very fast pace to giving himself a bit of time to reset. Yeah, it's good squash. Good squash from Bombalay. Well, both players, but Bombalay was the, the one who was able to find that opening and went for it. Chance here for Bombalay. Oh, it's a great shot. Great shot. Forced Evans into that back right corner. He's stretching. And you can see great replay here. Couldn't quite get himself still. And that was a very, very good quality finish from Bombalay. That's that a was a great shot. shot. Yeah, it was fantastic. He just <clears throat> ran it around the walls. He picks his moments to actually take it in a little bit lower, doesn't he? Maybe with a bit more, a bit more pace. Great oh, shot. Wonderful finish. Sort of fanning it a little bit, using the wrist and taking it to the side. Clever shot that from just Evans. Rolled the racket. Deceptive, isn't it? Very. Well, it's a tough finish there for, for Evans. Absolutely furious with that. It's a little bit fortunate in the in the back of the court, but Bombalay still looking as, as casual as ever, playing some fantastic squash, really frustrating the Welshman. As Bombalay takes the second game, 11-5 in 12 minutes, he leads by two games to love. What do you think Evans needs to needs to change or, or tweak a little bit. Obviously, he's finding himself too low down here. He's not played badly. He's not sure. played badly. He's started both games really well, positively. He's moving the ball around well. Sort of when it's got to that middle stage in the game that he has maybe hit a few errors or just stepped off the intensity a tiny bit, which makes a huge difference at this level. Good lift under pressure there from Evans. Oh, that's beautiful. It's great squash. Much deserved fist pump there. Just uh, drying his fingers and hand a little bit on this court. He's made a couple of er errors from that sort of area under pressure Bombalay when he's having to go from the right hand side of the court to the left into his backhand. Well, it has to be one saved, yep. Stroke to Evans. Down to three championship balls now for Bombalay. Well, there it is. That's the first outburst of emotion there you can see for Sebastian Bombalay. Much deserved there for the French number one seed. He, he proved that he was worthy of a number one seed. Played incredibly well during the whole week. And this, you say, for his best performance this final. 12-10, 11-5, 11-7 in 49 minutes. Very impressive.
Bombalay is the Scottish Open champion 2021. Sebastian, you must be absolutely delighted with that. Yeah, I'm very happy and relieved because uh, winning a tournament is always difficult and uh, it's, miss, it's my sixth title now and I'm, uh, I'm uh, very happy. Yeah, and you mentioned yesterday you played Amir Evans one time before and he beat you. Was this a perfect way of getting revenge? Yeah, of course, because uh, last time I lost, so here winning three love, it's, uh, it's good for me. Big round of applause for this year's winner of the men's Springfield Scottish Squash Open, Sebastian Bommelay.